trees of the garden. But of the fruit of this of the tree which is in the midst of the garden, God has said, You shall not eat it, nor shall you touch it, lest you die. Then the serpent said to the woman, You will not surely die. For God knows that in the day you eat of it, your eyes will be opened, and you will be like God, knowing good and evil. And it came to pass in the days of Ahaz, the son of Jotham, the son of Uzziah, king of Judah, that Brazen, the king of Syria, and Pekah, the son of Remaliah, king of Israel, went up toward Jerusalem to war against it, but could not prevail against it. <laughs> Disgrace. 
they have a right to divorce her quietly. But after he has considered this, an angel of the Lord appeared to him in a dream and said, Joseph, son of David, do not be afraid to take Mary home as your wife. And it came to pass in those days that they went out to a decree from Caesar Augustus that all the world should be taxed. And this taxing was first made when Serenus was governor of Syria. And all went to be taxed, everyone into his own city. And Joseph also went up from Galilee, out of the city of Nazareth, into Judea, unto the city of David. God from Genesis to Revelation. In Genesis, Jesus is our creator. In Exodus, the Passover land. In Leviticus, high priest. In Numbers, water in the desert. In Deuteronomy, the our eagle wings of deliverance. In Joshua, commander of the army of the Lord. In Judges, is the Lord of peace. In Ruth, is our redeemer. In First Samuel, is our prophet, priest, and king. Luke chapter 2, from verse 6 to verse 14. And so it was that while they were there, the days were accomplished and she, that she should be delivered. And she brought forth her first son and wrapped him in a swaddling clothes and laid him in a man manger, because there was no room for them in the inn. This is the second anniversary, and you are already with the ministry. You are leading the ministry. You are guiding the ministry. You are shepherding the ministry. And so, Lord, I pray that your presence will be with the ministry. Amen. The wonder of favor. I declare this wonder will follow you. Amen. Life was the light of rain. And the light shined in darkness, and darkness conquered the clouds. There was a man sent from God whose name was John. The same came for a witness to bear witness of the light that all men through him might believe. He was not that light, but was sent to bear witness of that light. That was the true light, which lighted every man that cometh into the world. Well, I can say that this is exactly the ministry of the Lord Jesus Christ. When Jesus Christ came into the world, he was going about doing good, helping people, meeting people's needs. And that was why people were following him. People were not following him primarily because they want salvation. People were following him because he was caring for their needs. So this is exactly the ministry of the Lord. The carol is about singing praise to God, Almighty, who brought salvation to mankind. The journey so far, I will say, it's not that it's all rosy. There are difficulties. It's not even of resources. It's not of finance. Because I, we don't get subvention from anybody. It's not, it's not the government. It's an NGO that is self being propagated. But God has been using other people to support us. And the, the miracles have been coming. And the testimonies are abound that during the administrations, people have testified that they, they receive favor of God. They receive deliverance. They receive healing. And that is the joy of the ministry.